been a morning full of rumors. Many people saying that the death of this 10-year-old boy was the result of repeated bullying. But his family wants to set the record straight. And now they're calling for lawmakers for help. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Twilon Nugent was there today when the family of the young boy who died spoke to the community about his passing. His death was not a suicide. His death had nothing to do with bullying. My son's death was an accident. It was ruled an accident. Addressing rumors circulating on social media, Chanel Halsey, the mother of South Buffalo Charter fifth grader Zion Halsey, made it clear her son's death on Monday was not a suicide. He did not bring any harm to himself on purpose. He did not commit suicide. He's 10 years old. Shortly before the boy's mother spoke, parents and students rallied outside the school calling for an end to what they say is a bullying problem and asking administration to do something about it. But again, Chanel Halsey emphasized bullying was not the reason for her son's death. It has nothing to do with bullying. It has nothing to do with the things that's been going around on Facebook. Like, none of that is true. My son died from an accident, and that's clear, and that's what it is. But shortly after Zion's mother spoke, the boy's grandfather confronted Superintendent Brian Wiesinger, insisting his late grandson was the victim of bullying. And has anything changed on the bus where the bullying occurs? We monitor busing as well, just as, as we do classrooms. Are there monitors we, on the bus? Yes or no? We don't, we don't uh, own the buses. They're not our buses. Zion's grandfather says while bullying may not have been the single factor in his death, he says it was a contributing factor and a recurring problem. He is now calling on legislators for reform. There has to be some sort of legislation put in place now requiring anyone that receives federal funding, anyone that receives state funding for transportation. It is now a requirement on every bus there should be a monitor. Lackawanna police have released a statement saying that Zion Halsey's death was an accidental hanging. They say it happened on Monday around 4 p.m. Captain Joseph Leo of Lackawanna PD says he, quote, truly believes this was not a suicide. Live in studio, Tweelon Nugent, 7 Eyewitness News. All right.